we finally got our first snow and um, I wasn't prepared. I've been waiting for the snow, but I I didn't fix the snow plow. So I'm gonna do that today. This is from a garden tractor and it's got the hydraulic angling here. And that hydraulic cylinder, you have already seen it probably because I use it for the hydraulic thumb. So I'm gonna put a quick connector somewhere here and then uh, put that back here. And uh, this is one and a half meters long. So I think it will be really good on that, uh, on the excavator. The first step will be to remove all of this stuff here because there's some kind of a mechanism here. I think this is supposed to be like a skid to make it easier to slide under the garden tractor. So I'm just gonna remove everything. Now that I got all of this stuff off, I can start to mock up and see where I should put that quick connector. But first, see I gotta 
I gotta cut it loose. This is the quick connector and this is this crappy thing that I welded to it because I can see it's just, I don't know, it's made of spaghetti or something. any more welding I'm gonna make sure it fits yeah, I think that will work and nothing interferes there or there and then the hydraulic cylinder cylinder will be down here. Okay. That will be good. Now that I welded this together, uh, I have to 
look at this here because you see they just kept going the cutting edge is uh, is worn down and they just kept going here so I'm gonna turn the cutting edge around and um, I think I'm gonna weld a pipe to it because I, I've tried that before on gravel and it really works well So I finished building this uh, yesterday, but it, it got so dark, so I couldn't film uh, when I tried it out. And the snow was, it, it was really wet and heavy snow, so it was really the worst kind of condition uh, to snow plow. And the gravel beneath, it, it ha it, it's not frozen, so yeah, it's, it's like the first time I plow snow each year is always the worst one. And then you get this layer of uh, ice and snow that you you can really push on. Um, I discovered something also, I'm gonna show you. This tool here to release this quick connector, as you can see it, it doesn't really work so well now because, uh, I mean the, the, the snow plow is in the way. So I'm gonna try and, and bend this a bit so it's be, it will be angled a bit and then maybe I can use this also to clean out cracks and stuff like that I really need some kind of like a welding shed
is really super soft as you can see.
Okay, so I tried the snow plow in some gravel, in some snow and some wood chips and uh, I think it, it works kind of good. Uh, I need to practice my skills. It's a, it's a lot of controls to, to handle when you're plowing with this. Uh, it was much easier with a garden tractor or with a, like a riding mover or an ATV or something like that. But um, I'll wait until the season is over, until I do a, like a review on this and maybe I'll do some improvements on it also during the season, we'll see. Anyway, uh, 20, 2020 is coming to an end and in 2021 I will probably reach a thousand subscribers. If, if nothing drastic happens then uh, uh, I'll reach it and uh, that's kind of big for me. And um, I would like to thank everyone who's subscribing and watching. It, uh, it's really fun uh, to see the, the channel growing a bit. And um, I'm planning on doing a thousand subscriber special. And uh, I have a couple of good ideas. But if you have something that you want to see or something that you think would be kind of pro appropriate for a thousand subscribers, then um, write a comment down below. So what will happen in 21? Uh, well, I have, will have that video. I will do some comparison videos, uh, chainsaws, uh, some electric chainsaw or battery powered, um, uh, riding movers, uh, push movers. There will be some more excavating videos, uh, building the stable videos, maybe do something in here. Uh, some more ATV videos, of course. And um, well, we'll see what happens. It's, uh, I always get, have a lot of things to do, so there's no shortage of uh, material. Uh, there's only shortage of time. Anyway, thank you for watching and bye.